Southport is the place that I call home. Um, I've been there and lived there for about uh, 27 years now. Um, Southport is a sleepy community when I came, a uh, fishing village basically. A lot of the people in the area were fishermen or cr uh, crabbers or clammers. And one of the best things that I love to do now is to go down to the waterfront, to the yacht basin, and get fresh seafood and take it home and boil it up with um, french fries and um, cornbread. And if I could make a lemon pie, I like to do the lemon pie too. But uh, Southport is one of the most beautiful communities I think that I've ever lived in. We have live oak trees that line the road coming in. So when you come into the city, you see these huge trees all over the community of Southport in the historic area. Uh, one of the particular ones is the Four Sisters, which is um, just a little bit off the waterfront. And it's four trees that grew in together that made one huge tree that I think probably is in a 15-foot diameter or so, so it's, it's great. But after work, in the afternoons, the most important thing I like to do is to go and sit on the front porch at my mother-in-law's house. Uh, it overlooks the river, uh, the mouth of the Cape Fear River, which is the space where the Atlantic Ocean and the intercoastal and the Cape Fear River all come together. And we can sit there and look over to Battery Island and watch the ibises and the herons and birds come in to roost in the afternoon. And you can see the daddies or the mama birds going back out to get seafood to bring back to the little ones that are in the hatcheries over there. But um, a lot of the big ships, the ocean-going vessels, come in through the mouth of the Cape Fear. So you can sit there, sit back, watch the sunset, watch the birds, and huge uh, 900 foot shipping ocean going vessels come through, which is always exciting to do, I think. And then, of course, mamas have their babies out playing in the little park in front of us, and um, it's just a great place. Antique stores, restaurants, uh, novelty shops. Uh, love to take the grandchildren when they come into town to the novelty shops and let them pick out that special something for them to enjoy. Great place.